ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Far Rock 22M, aka Infamous Owen, Infamous underscore Owen on IG. Right now I'm in the city, Lower Manhattan, as you can see, that's the Freedom Tower right there. And today is 910. It's not 11 it's 9-10. So right now I'm about to just uh head to Jersey real quick. But I'll head to that uh that cookie spot, you know what I'm saying, up there in Harrison. Hopefully I get a little something for that promotion. But anyway, all um, so, when I seen that Freedom Tower, kind of reminded me, and I'm like, damn, this is the day before it all happened. So, yeah, man. Man, it's just September 11th. It's chaos down here. You know what I'm saying? Oh, no. And before, yeah, as you know, there was two buildings standing there. So, but I can imagine what was going on down here at the time when I'm planes hit there with buildings can you imagine a pandemonium and here it is right I remember you know they used to have this uh, Century 21 store I don't know if they still have it but I used to go to Century 21 a lot especially when I was in high school and if my if my brother didn't have to go to court that day who knows I would have probably cut out of school just to go do a little shopping that day because it was the beginning of the school year not mind you so a lot of times some people wasn't really getting settled into like their first two weeks inside the school you know what I'm saying but um anyway yeah um but yeah so I ain't got much time on this but yeah and they did a whole lot over here you know this is where ground zero was Same. Check this out. Yeah. So that's when the towers kind of once stood. And you know, this is the path train area. Right now, we on Church Street. Church in Fulton. So for those that's from out of town, that never been out here before, this is what it's like, you know, a lot of people out here. So you can imagine a busy Tuesday morning, you know, people going to work, and that happens. Like, I can't imagine just hearing a plane right now down here. So I know that had to been weird. Yeah, man, so, and like I said, I made a video about 9-11 before on one of my, uh, on the previous, on one of the previous videos, and what was going on that day, but I was in Far Rockwood, so, and I remember that Far Rockwood was very quiet, you know, there's people doing stuff, but it was, from my side, it was kind of quiet, you know, a lot of people was out, some people wasn't, you know, my area was a little, little quiet, but people was out, but it was quiet. You know what I'm saying? It makes sense. That's how I remember it. And I just remember just walking around the neighborhood and everything was like very serene. Everything just, it just didn't feel real. Like it felt like a glitch in the matrix. Like somebody hit the reset button. But hey, it is what it is. So um yeah, I'm gonna shorten this video up. You know, I gotta go catch this path train real quick. But I just had to definitely put something out there and you know, rest in peace to those that, you know, lost their lives that day. You know, salute to the heroes of that day. You know, the firemen, the NYPD, you know, Port Authority, New Jersey Transit, all kinds of people was involved in that situation. And I salute them and so many, so many other agencies that took a loss in that situation. You know what I mean? Salute to them because, you know, a lot of them were first responders and, you know, even those that made it out, you know what I mean? They still got to suffer for what they saw and what they had to deal with that day. It's crazy, man. So I salute them. And, you know, I'm going to cut this short. I'm going to get one more view of this real quick.
out here looking like a tourist. All right, y'all, take it easy. Y'all have a safe one.